Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your Silver Sea experts, and today I have the great pleasure of sharing with you the beautiful Silver Muse. This ship is true six-star ultra luxury. It delivers high inclusions and it delivers incredible service. Every single suite here on board gets butler service and it's the people that really make this cruise exceptional. But you'll also find that the ship is exceptionally designed. Both beautiful decor, wonderful specialty restaurants, included restaurants, you're also gonna have quite a bit of entertainment, lifelong learning experiences, all delivered in an ultra luxury way. Now I've started off right here above the pool deck and I'm gonna to tour all the public spaces here today, but keep in mind when you're ready to book this incredible ship or any rumor suite with Royal Caribbean, Celebrity or Silver Sea, make sure you reach out to the experts at Hard Travel or book it right on hardtravel.com. We know we can help craft your perfect cruise vacation of a lifetime for you, your friends, family or group at an amazing value and get the Hard Travel signature service every step of the way. Now the Silver Muse is a fan favorite of Silver Sea guests. It fits into that class of ships with the Silver Muse, the Silver Dawn, and the Silver Moon that our guests come back to time and time again. You're gonna find a lot of the Silver Sea favorites here on the ship, along with some wonderful upgrades and new concepts. Now behind me, you're gonna find the pool deck down below. What I really appreciate is it's a really nice long pool, so if you wanna do laps in the morning or later in the evening, it's perfect opportunity for that. You also have the seating area that wraps all the way around the sides where you can sit, dip your toes in the water, maybe cool off if the ship's in a warmer climate, or you can hop in one of those two hot tubs as well to heat up when you're in the cooler climates. There's tons of seating all the way around. You've got tables and chairs here in the middle. You've got seating under the shade wrapped all the way around on the sides, and then anchored right at the far side, you're gonna find the pool bar. Every great pool needs a wonderful bar. They're gonna provide service for you down below, and then there's also more bar service up above as well. So they'll have different seating that they'll set up here. You're also gonna find the walking track that goes around. You've kind of got one half, or you can do the full walking track if you want a little bit longer. Now to complement the fantastic pool bar, you've got the pool grill here. Now it's a multi-function concept, so it opens up later in the morning, goes to earlier in the evening, and this is where you can find those classic elevated pool options. So you've got all your favorite burgers and fish burgers, hot dogs, but you're also gonna find some delicious wraps, the fish sandwich is really exceptional. They've got lots of delicious options that are upgraded. That's the concept that you're gonna find all around the ship. You can get those classics. You can also get them taken to another level. Now you've got lots of seating out here, and of course it extends on the side as well. So that is during the day, but later on in the evening, this transforms into a delicious hot rocks experience. So you can have all of your favorite options here. You can cook it yourself. Of course, they'll be happy to assist you with it as well. But it's a really cool experience to do, especially with the open air out there. I love dining al fresco. Of course, they've got heaters here as well if you're traveling in Alaska or Norway or some of the cooler environments. But once again, this is dining from later in the morning until late into the evening as you enjoy, whether it's the delicious pool grill or the hot rocks experience. Now, pizza originally comes from the Italian city of Napoli, and here on board, pizza comes from Spacanapoli. It is this wonderful restaurant up here. You've got the outdoor seating. It is fully covered, and then they have some heaters out here as well, depending on the elements. But you're gonna find delicious pizzas. Now here they've got several pizza ovens, they've got the classics from Naples, and they've also created their own, but you can also get exactly what you'd like if you wanna combine and move around. Now there's seating up here, you've got tables for two, four, they wrap all the way around the side. Of course, you can always ask for items from the menu down below from the pool grill as well. But if you love delicious pizza made the way it should be, you're gonna love it here on board. All the way in the aft of the pool deck, you're gonna find this jacuzzi hot tub, and you also have these great day bed options. Now, one of the very unique features of this ship and pretty much all the Silver Sea ships built before it is that you don't have any suites in the back of the ship. It's all public space and everyone can capture all of those incredible views. I love sitting up here. I think it's perfect, especially on a beautiful day at sea or even one in land where you could take advantage of a place to sit, relax, enjoy the incredible views, and then of course, hop on into the hot tub. Set all the way forward in the top of the ship like a crown, you'll find the observation lounge. Now this is that great place to be when you're cruising through some of the scenic parts of our world. It's also just a great place to come, relax during the day, or have a cocktail in the evening. So there's a lot of seating up here. It all faces out at the beautiful windows that are floor to ceiling. You're gonna see larger sets of seating for six and eight. You've got seats for two. And then right around the corner there, you'll find the main bar. As I mentioned, they'll provide bar service to this entire area in the evening. They'll use this space for get togethers, cocktail parties, but it's really all about the observation of the incredible views from here. 
So you've got high top seating on the far side and as we continue along right around the corner, you're gonna find the library. Now I love the fact that they have a full library here on board. It's a curated library. They also have a book exchange with the whole world going digital these days. For me, I love to grab onto a real book, sit back and read, and this is a phenomenal spot for it. So you see you've got books on either side here, fiction and nonfiction, and a great book exchange where maybe you can pick up your next favorite book right here on board. Set all the way aft on deck nine, you'll find the Panorama Lounge, and it truly is a great place to find a view. You've got wraparound 180 degree windows here. There's also a wonderful terrace off the back where you can sit, get those incredible wake views as the ship sails away from all kinds of destinations around the world. Now this is that classic cruise ship lounge. You'll find live music here. In fact, tucked in the corner, you've got the piano and the bandstand. There's also the DJ booth just behind because this is also where you'll find great music later into the evening. But this space is used for all styles of entertainment, whether it's trivia, a get together, or even certain types of lectures, they can use this space for it. And anchored right at the corner, you'll find the bar. The bar does provide service throughout this entire area, later in the afternoon and evening, and then also to the outside area. My wife loves this space because you have incredible natural light. She uses it when she does her quilting. Once again, I love the outside space as well. Having those incredible views is really spectacular. This entire lounge gets lots of natural light, and of course, it's a great place to get together. Now, if you're looking for some great shopping options here on board, there's several boutiques. Just behind, you're gonna find they have a lot of high-end luxury handbags. You've got different styles of jewelry. You can spoil your spouse or just upgrade your collection. On the other side here, you're gonna find that you have a variety of perfumes and different cosmetic items. All of this is duty-free, so a lot of our guests will stack up on them. And then just behind, you're also gonna find a lot of different clothing items. It's usually more specific as to where you're traveling. Colder climates, you're gonna have jackets and things. If you're in the warmer climates, you're gonna find some lightweight options, some swimsuits, but they have a wide variety to choose from if you left something at home or if you wanna try something new. This space is the card and game room. It's exactly what it sounds like. They've got a wide variety of games for you to choose from. They'll also have some great competitions in here. If you're into bridge, you're into different styles of games, here is a great place to gather, especially on those longer cruises. This ship does some incredible tours around the world, and here you'll find a great place to gather with friends. You'll also oftentimes find a puzzle that people are working on. It's kind of a collaborative concept, but you can come in here and utilize the space to play cards, games, and puzzles. Now, if you fancy a cigar, the Connoisseur's Corner is a perfect spot for you. They've got a wide variety to choose from. It is a smoking lounge, so you can enjoy a cigar. They also have some delicious cognacs and whiskeys and a pretty great variety of that for you to choose from as well. So you'll see the really nice, large, oversized, comfortable furniture here. It is perched in the aft corner of the ship, so you get some incredible views. Right around the corner here, there's even more seating. Once again, this is that place to light up a favorite stogie, sit back, relax, and enjoy. The Arts Cafe is the classic coffee shop here on board. It's a beautiful, intimate setting set in the aft corner of the ship, so you capture incredible views wherever it is that you sit. So you've got seats along the windows here. You also have some great seating outdoors, so you can grab your coffee, head on out, and enjoy there with those incredible views. Now, as you can see wrapped all around, there's a little nook here for seating. There's a couple more on the far side. They've got some great grab-and-go food items. They also have some infused waters and juices, and they have the full bar here as well. But it's that great coffee shop style experience. Grab a pastry, your favorite cappuccino, latte, Americano, espresso, whatever it is that you enjoy, you're gonna enjoy it right here at no additional cost. Now, if you enjoy gaming on vacation, they do have a casino here on board. It's not a huge one, but it's got what you're looking for. So you've got all kinds of different games just behind me. So those classic slot machine items on the other side as well. You're gonna find roulette over here. They've got poker, and then they also have blackjack. Once again, it's a smaller setup here, but if you enjoy maybe spending part of your evening here gaming, you can enjoy the casino here on board. This beautiful space is Silver Note. Now it's a dining and musical experience that you get to enjoy together. You can think about those classic iconic Manhattan jazz clubs. That's really what this is, where you're gonna find the food perfectly paired with the notes. So you're gonna have wonderful jazz musicians on board. You'll see behind me, you've got the piano. You, they always have a fantastic vocalist as well. And the idea is that they pair all the courses with the music. Just behind me, you'll see the bar, so you can actually head on in early, grab a drink at the bar, and you can even grab a seat there later on in the evening as well to listen to the music. But this is all about having a unique experience where you pair music, delicious food, and have a wonderful night out. 
all the way aft, you'll find La Terrazza. Now, La Terrazza means the terrace in Italian, and you're gonna have an incredible outdoor dining area, but this really is that casual dining option where you can have buffet style for breakfast and lunch each day, and it turns into an Italian specialty in the evening. Now let's walk through here. You can see what the buffet style setup is all about. They've got lots of delicious and fresh options to choose from. So you've got a salad bar set up here. Now keep in mind, this is lunch. You've got some wonderful assortment of different salads and cheeses. I love the incredible assortment from Kaiseki as well. They were making it down there, brought that up for you. You can head down there to lunch if you'd like as well. More salads down the middle, some delicious charcuterie style options with cheeses, breads, meats. And then you also have the most important thing tucked in the corner. It's the dessert, but there's more than one dessert bar. We'll take you through there as well. All along the back, you're gonna find the hot items. So you've got roasted chicken today. You've got some pot pie, coconut shrimp. They've got lots of delicious options and different cultural options as well. There's some wonderful Indian food here today. Now keep in mind for breakfast, you might find eggs to order here, you know, pancakes, French toast, all of your favorite options here. And of course, we'd be remiss if we didn't take you to the second dessert station. You can see all of those beautiful cakes and pies. You've got different styles of desserts and of course, fruit and cookies. Now I mentioned that this also turns into a specialty restaurant in the evening. Now you do need to make a reservation. It's one of the more popular ones. It does not charge anything additional, but it's that classic Italian style option. Delicious pastas, antipastos, all your favorite dishes right here inside or outside. Now inside here, you can see they have tables for four, six, two, they've got tables around the, the windows. And what I love is you've got that incredible 180 degree wrap around view. Now, one of the interesting features is the windows actually can open up. So on a beautiful day, you can have that indoor outdoor feel or you can step out and enjoy the terrace proper. Let's head out there now. Now, those of you who know me know that I love the aft of the ship. And one of the things I love about the design of the ship is that so much of that public space is in the aft where everybody can enjoy the incredible views. From here, you can dine from La Terrazza. Once again, breakfast, lunch, or specialty dinner. You've got these seats that line all the way around the side of the ship where you can get those amazing views, whether you're cruising through the scenic parts of our world or just out to sea. Now, in addition, I wanted to point out that they do have heaters out here. So if you're traveling in Alaska or Norway or one of the cooler destinations, they've got you covered there as well. Our next stop is the Zagara Spa and Fitness Center. And for me personally, nothing says vacation like an incredible relaxing massage time at the spa using the thermal suite, the saunas, those types of things. To me, it's really all about that relaxation, but it's much more than that here. You've got a wide variety of wraps, facials, acupuncture, and you even have quite a few retail options to choose from. Let's tour it now. Our next stop is the full service salon. Now this ship does some shorter cruises, some incredible longer cruises, and some people turn it into a residence at sea. So having a salon is a great touch, whether you want a revolutionary new hairstyle or just get done up before you head out and have an amazing night on board the Silver Muse, this is that perfect stop. So there's several different hair stations. You also have a barber shop for the gents. On the far side here, you're gonna find manicures and pedicures. Now these are really popular on board, especially during sea days. So make sure you book those as soon as you can. But once again, all the things that you love about going to a beauty salon at home, you can have right here on board. Now, when you arrive for your spa treatment, generally your first stop is to head to the locker room, get ready, put on that robe, and then head into here to the mood room. Now, this is that relaxation zone. They'll come in, provide you with a little bit of paperwork so that your therapist can get to know you, the things that you like and don't like, so they can plan the perfect option for you. It's that great place to get in the Zen mindset. And then also after your treatment, you can come sit, relax a bit. You're gonna find some waters and teas over here, and it's just a really soothing place. Now, a great complimentary option on board is the sauna and steam room. So there's two separate sets. You've got them here for the gents, just across for the ladies. You can utilize this as you'd like throughout the cruise. What I also really appreciate, they've got some incredible views out to the ocean. So you can sit, work through the circuit. You can weave it into your fitness routine or just come, heat on up and head on out. Now this is where the magic happens. This is one of the treatment rooms here on board. As I mentioned, they have a wide variety of massages. Personally, I love the hot stones. If I'm traveling a long distance, I really love to get that deep tissue massage, kind of get everything moving after a long flight. But you'll find here that they have a variety of wraps, facials, acupuncture. They really have you covered with all kinds of different spa style treatments. You can combine them for multiples or just enjoy one. But this is a sample of one of the rooms here. Of course, because they have the wraps, they also have a shower as well. Lots of different options, but we highly recommend that you pre-book, especially on sea days, as those will be the first to go. Now, if you wanna take your spa experience to another level, you definitely want to book the thermal suite. Now there's several different options in here. There's limited capacity, so you wanna book it as soon as you get on board, if it's something you're interested for a day or for the whole cruise. Now, just in here, you've got a large sauna, 
You've got shower here, and then just behind me, you're gonna have another steam room. What I really like is right around the corner, you also have the hammam room. It's kind of another level of steam where you can kind of cycle through all of them. And then as I head further aft, you're gonna find this wonderful relaxation area as part of the thermal suite. So there's several beds here, extra comfy loungers. From here, you can check out the incredible views out the aft of the ship. And another really wonderful inclusion is just outside, you're gonna have a Thessalo therapy pool where you can sit and relax. You've got the metal loungers with the bubbles that come up, the different jets. But from there, you also get those incredible aft-facing views. Now to complement the spa experience, they also have a great fitness center here on board. You've got all the equipment that you need to continue your exercise regime here at sea, or maybe even start a brand new one. Now in here, you're gonna find quite a few different circuit style machines. So you can work your entire upper body, lower body, and abs. Over here, you're gonna find the dumbbells. You've got a wide assortment of them. And then you also have the benches here. There's some medicine balls, balance balls over in the corner. And then right through the door, you're gonna find the aerobics fitness studio. So in here, they'll put classes together, whether you wanna do some stretching or yoga, something a little more aerobic as well. You've got the bar along the mirrors on either side. You can see you've got the blocks for yoga. You also have the yoga mats. And right around the corner, you're gonna have the foam rollers. So you can utilize this space however you'd like. They'll also do classes in here so you can learn different things about fitness, nutrition. In fact, there's a projector and a screen that'll come down as well. And what better place to do cardio than with the best views on the planet? So you've got different styles of ellipticals. You also are gonna find bikes. You have treadmills and then they wrap all the way around. So wherever it is that you're doing that exercise, you're gonna get those incredible views out the aft and the side of the ship. Now the Italian concept of Dolce Vita is the sweet life. It's where you enjoy everything that life has to offer, food, drink, family, friends, and gathering together. And this is the Dolce Vita Lounge. On the far side, you do have a bar. It's also where you'll gather together for some wonderful music. There's always a piano player here in the afternoons and evenings. They'll use this space for everything from bingo to trivia. It's really kind of like the living room of the ship. Now, it's a wonderful spot to stop by, listen to some great music before you head out to dinner or stop by after. Once again, throughout the day, it's also a great place to grab a book and enjoy. Now tucked in the corners of the lounge on one side, you're gonna find the shore concierge. So we always recommend that you pre-book your excursions even before you arrive. Many of our guests do book it included with Silver Sea, but if you're looking for some unique, independent, one-off excursions, we can take care of those details for you as well. But you always wanna get that set before you arrive to the ship. The shore concierge can also assist with different things on shore as well, but it's best to be prepared and then have them assist as needed. On the other side, you're gonna find the reception. So this is the guest services desk. Think of it as the front desk of a hotel. Now, I always recommend that you do all your business during the cruise. First day, last day, guests tend to have a few more questions. Maybe they're settling up their bill, so it does get a little busier, but they're here to answer all the questions about your rooms, about money, and really take care of the basics of the trip. Now, Silver Sea offers incredible trips all around the world. They have all seven continents covered from their incredible expedition product all the way through their ocean product. And they know that you're gonna have such a great time on board that the best time to book your next cruise is while you're here. We recommend that you stop by the cruise consultant. They're gonna answer all your questions and help you get the next cruise booked with some promotions that won't be available once you return to shore. Now, keep in mind, if we book your cruise, they're gonna take care of all the details. It'll come right back to us so we can start servicing right away. But if you wanna try hard travel for the first time, reach out before you go. We'll give you all the information so you can connect here on board and then we can take care of all the details, add the hard travel amenities, value value and service along the way. The Venetian Lounge is the classic show lounge here on board. So you'll have Broadway style entertainment. They bring on a lot of different guest entertainers and it's also a place where you can come to learn. Silver Sea brings together some of the best minds when it comes to lecturers and entertainers. So here you can learn about the destinations you visit and they might even bring on a local act from where you're visiting. So you can see it's stadium style seating. It slowly goes up as it gets higher here. You've got booth style seats and then just in between, you're gonna have the individual seats as well. And each one does have a cocktail table. So if you want to have a great show after dinner, this is that spot, or also to come and learn during the day, you can enjoy that here as well. Growing up, I always visited my grandmother's house, and every time I'd walk in, I'd hear the voices of Jacques Pepin and Julia Child. I grew up loving French cuisine and learning about it because my grandmother did, and this spot here on board, La Dame, is that perfect place to have a wonderful French meal. So you're gonna find that it's exquisite. It's quite over the top as well as most French food is. You're gonna love that butter, but they have a wide variety to choose from here and they can have it elegantly paired with delicious wines. 
So set in the middle of the restaurant, you've got this beautiful wine room here, and then you have seating wrapped all the way around. Now it's a very intimate setting. You do wanna pre-book this. It does require reservations that come at an additional cost, but it's a delicious upgrade option. And you can see it's a small amount of space. They really have that high quality and attention to detail, which is why you need to reserve early. The concept of Kaiseki is meticulous arrangement and attention to detail. And if you love delicious Japanese food, this is a great spot for you. So during lunch each and every single day, you can stop by here, enjoy some wonderful food, some sushi. They also have some Japanese style options. And then later for dinner, the menu does transition. It does come at an additional cost then. You definitely wanna pre-reserve because it's a small intimate venue with highly upgraded delicious food. So there's two teppanyaki tables down the middle as well. That's an option that you can take advantage of for dinner. Now, if you're looking for that meticulous attention to detail and the delicious seafood options and options from the land of Japan, make sure you stop by and reserve Kaiseki. If you love delicious Asian flavors, Indochine is the spot for you. This is where you're gonna have dinner each and every single night if you'd like. It complements all the specialty restaurants and complimentaries here on board. It is a complimentary option and you're gonna find fusion from Vietnam, Thailand, Cambodia, China, Japan, Korea, all over Asia. It's truly a fusion style menu where you'll find all of your favorite flavor profiles come together. Now anchored right in the middle, you're gonna find a bar and of course they'll provide bar service throughout the dining experience. You've got booth style seats here that wrap around. You've got tables for two, four, and right down the middle, they can accommodate much larger groups. In fact, they can even use this space for tastings as well. So it's a dinner option here each and every single day. You do not need to pre-reserve, but you'll enjoy the delicious Asian flavors. Dining is a huge part of any cruise or vacation experience, and Atlantide is the main dining room here on board. So if you like to have that seated a la carte dining, this is your spot. It's included for breakfast, lunch, and dinner generally each and every single day. So there's a lot of seating in here. You've got the full bar right here at the front. So maybe you wanna stop by, have a drink before you have dinner or after. They also, of course, provide bar service throughout the entire restaurant. Front. You've got larger tables here for six. You've got larger tables in the back as well. You can really sit as you'd like. Now, once again, this is that spot where you can try new things and include the deliciousness that is Silver Sea. You're gonna find a wide variety and it rotates each and every single day. Some of my favorite food options I've found on board cruise ships. Maybe it's not something I would have ordered on land looking at that price tag, but having it included here, it's that perfect place to try new things or go back to your favorites time and time again. And you'll find them all here. Once again, breakfast, lunch, dinner, all a la carte and plated. Now the activities room is one for all age groups. You can see here, they've got different styles of video games. So if you wanna come on in and play, you can. Of course, if you're traveling with a multi-generational family group, it's great to have something for every age. Continuing along, they'll have more activities in here that you can check out and utilize. They also have this little seating area here with the bean bags. And just outside, you're gonna find that you've got ping pong and some other fun activities that they'll set up like cornhole. Just a great little addition if you're looking for some different styles of fun on board. Now, there's so many fun things to do on a cruise ship. It's really about you and what you like. I know my wife and I, the first time we cruised together 20 plus years ago, we loved playing ping pong with each other. It was a blast and they also had some great tournaments and some fun. I've also done some really cool longer cruises. You might even get some great competition as well. Woo, I actually won one, who knew? Now around the ship, you'll find a series of laundrettes. So these are for guests to use, come at no additional cost. If you wanna do your own laundry, keep in mind you can send it out, kind of hotel style prices, but depending on the suite you're in, it may be included. Now here you've got your washer and dryer, pretty straightforward. If you wanna do your laundry while traveling, this is a great option for you. I'm sure you can see by now why we at Har Travel and our guests absolutely love the Silver Muse, her sister ships, and the entire Silver Sea fleet. It's all about exceptional service, delicious food, all kinds of inclusions, but really having that intimate experience where you can sit back, relax, and have the vacation of a lifetime and have everything you need right here next to you. Whether it's the entertainment or the dining, whatever it is that you're looking for, Hard Travel is the best way to book your Silver Sea, Royal Caribbean, or Celebrity Cruise. We know we can help craft your perfect cruise vacation of a lifetime for you, your friends, family, or group at an amazing value, and get the Hard Travel signature service every step of the way.